Hello and welcome to this video presentation of data management in the Benita UI Designer. Let me tell you more about this very powerful and easy to use feature. We'll explore the business data model directly from the UI Designer and use it to create user interfaces and variables in a few clicks. Let's start by exploring the data model. In the data model tab, the graph icon allows you to visualize and explore the BDM using the GraphQL Voyager library. A graphical view of the relationship between the business objects with their attributes is displayed in a new tab of the browser. The left side allows you to explore the BDM tree or to search for a specific object or attribute. You can also use the graphical view to explore the model. Now let's see how to display information about business objects on a living application page. We see here, in the H2 database schema, the customer information object, taken from the customer list example. The idea is to create a page to display them directly. We open a blank page in the UA Designer. On the left, we can see the list of objects in the database. Just drag and drop the object on the central screen, and this opens the configuration wizard to define the type of query we want to use to display this information. For example, we will choose to have up to 10 items per page for the folders. When I save, you can see that the UI designer has created the variables, widgets, and linked all the information to display all the records in a table. When we select one of the rows, only information is automatically displayed. Now we can adapt this configuration and behavior to the project needs. This ends the overview of the project documentation generator. Feel free to consult the documentation for more detail. There are also many of the other features of Benita 711 that you can find in the general presentation video.